Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven, and in today's video, I would like to show you how you can configure dashboard in Viva Connections. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So in one of my earlier videos, I introduced you to Viva Connections, and essentially uh, what it is, um, uh, it's the internet, all right, your company's internet, for example, uh, embedded in Microsoft Teams, all right? So you can have Microsoft Teams, you know, where people collaborate and chat and schedule meetings. And then with the click of a button, they would also get to see the, you know, the internet that you build. So this way they don't need to navigate away to uh, another website or, you know, another browser and open up the SharePoint uh, internet URL. Well, let me show you uh, another functionality that's available uh, when you uh, configure Viva Connections. So when you configure uh, uh, Viva Connections uh, and essentially register your site as a home site, you also get this dashboard. And essentially what it is, um, and you know, these are like different, you know, personalized applications that are presented to the user, right? Most of the information on your internet might be static, right? Company news announcements, you know, policies, links, and so on. However, if you notice uh, right in here, it shows me the stuff that's personalized to me, you know, so based on the user who is logged in, it shows you maybe my tasks that I, I do, uh, some news and announcements that are targeted for me, you know, some of the approvals I need to uh, take care of and so on. So how to configure this uh, Viva dashboard? Uh, essentially what you need to do is this. Uh, you need to navigate on your, obviously, uh, you know, home site. Uh, uh, you need to navigate to gear icon, uh, manage Viva connections. And then uh, one of the choices would be uh, dashboard. And this is where you can uh, configure it. Now, I already configured that with some of those uh, personalized apps. Uh, let me click the edit button. Now, um, this uh, you know dashboard can be presented in both a desktop and mobile. So if I were to access my site you know, in the mobile experience, all right, uh, or go to Microsoft Teams, I would be able to also visualize this um, dashboard on a mobile device and it just kind of shows you um, how it will render on a mobile device, all right? But uh, we're on the desktop, so here we go. And like I said, I already configured a few uh, applications, but uh, you can just click add a card, all right? And this are all the different, uh, you know, cards you can add. For example, and I already added some of them. If you wanted to add a web link, uh, just like I did, you know, here's a card for that. Uh, if you wanted to add assigned uh, tasks, you know, just like I did. Uh, so essentially you just add all of this uh, different cards. Uh, there is not much to it. Uh, and after you're done, uh, you can preview and stuff like that. And uh, after that, you can republish it. Uh, so uh, here's another little thing you need to know. Uh, once you configure this dashboard, you can also embed it right on the page. And I kind of already did this, but let me show you how to do that. So you click the edit button, you know, edit the page. And let's say I want to edit here. And that's exactly what it's called. All right. You can just, um, you know, type it in the name or it's called dashboard for Viva uh, connections. And you can pretty much embed it uh, right on the SharePoint page. And of course, after this, you just need to republish to make sure that, um, you know, it will uh, appear on your page and here it is. And uh, super important, uh, obviously all this configuration happens on that SharePoint uh, home site, right? Uh, but uh, obviously if you configure Viva Connections from the Microsoft Teams admin center, uh, then the same site will appear in Microsoft Teams. So here we go, right? Um, again, I am in Microsoft Teams and here are my teams and I click on this, you know, on my internet and obviously I get to see pretty much the same thing I just showed you, right? Uh, you know, the same site and here, uh, here's my dashboard I already had before. Here is one I added just now. So that's all I really wanted to share in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com. And thank you for watching. Goodbye.